Did you know that you probably have transferable skills that could help you land a high paying tech role? Most people don't realize that. That's why in this video, I'm going to teach you how to use AI to rewrite your resume using your transferable skills so that you can land a high paying job in tech. Hey cyber heroes and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, I'm Void Clewis, an internationally recognized cybersecurity expert and I help people upgrade their jobs into a six figure tech career. If you want to join me on this journey, be sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel so that you're notified whenever I drop new content guaranteed to take your career to six figures and beyond. All right, cyber heroes, let's jump in. I am super excited about this video right here because this is so cool, man. We're going to be using AI, artificial intelligence to be able to find out how to transition into tech, cybersecurity, whatever specific niche you want to. I'm going to show you the step by step how to do this. The first thing is before we decide to make this transition into tech, we need to figure out what part of tech are we even going to transition into. Some parts are going to be better than others because of the skills that we already have. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go over to OpenAI, which is part of ChatGPT. And we're going to give the chat GPT some prompts. All right, guys, so we're on my computer right now. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to go give me some high paying cybersecurity career niches that don't require technical skills. Most people transitioning into tech don't have technical skills, right? So it only makes sense that we start with our strengths. We don't want to go to different areas that require skills like hacking and coding. Where we've never done anything like that before. We want to give ourselves a chance to win. So I'm going to submit this prompt and we're going to get the feedback. So we got cybersecurity risk analyst, cybersecurity consultant, cybersecurity policy analyst, cybersecurity auditor. It gives us a handful of things. So what I will do is I would copy this niche down to my worksheet so that I know exactly what to do moving forward. I would pick one of these things that kind of speak to me. I personally work in the cybersecurity governance risk and compliance GRC space. So that's what I would do. So let's get to our next prompt. So now that we have some career options to choose from, let's give the AI another prompt. What skills do I need to work in cybersecurity as a policy analyst? We want to ask this because in order for us to make this transition, we need to find the skills that we already have that match up with what the industry is looking for. So we're going to ask what skills do I need? Sometimes errors pop up. So we'll just hit it again. So it's going to give us a list of things that we need to be familiar with. And again, I'm going to take down these options on my paper and I'm going to evaluate which of these skills I already have. Right. That's the second step, because, again, we want to put ourselves in position to win. So we want to make sure that we are leveraging skills that we already have, not doing a whole bunch of things to try to learn new skills. Leverage what you already have so that you can make this career transition. OK, cyber heroes. So we've done the research now. We understand what skills are needed. We understand the high paying niche that we could walk into in transition. Now it's time to get the AI to build out our new profile to translate our skills over into this new niche that we're looking to transition to. Before we get into the details of rewriting the resume, now is a good time to like this video and subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell so that you're notified whenever I drop new content. So let's jump into my computer for that. So what we're going to do is we're going to use this AI to create a transitional resume for a a delivery truck driver, specifically transitioning into cybersecurity assurance, which is uh, GRC, Governance Risk and Compliance. So the first thing we're going to do, is we're going to give the AI a prompt. A prompt just means directions. So the directions I'm going to give it right now are going to be this. Today, you're going to be a world class resume writer who specializes in writing resume bullet points for people transitioning into a tech career. I'm going to show you one example of a good resume bullet point. Just read it. Don't explain it to me. After you acknowledge that you've read it, the resume bullet point, I'll give you further instructions. Ready? So let's go ahead and hit submit on that. So it's process it and then it's coming up with some thoughts of its own. And that's fine. That's fine. So we know that the AI has now acknowledged it. So what I want to do now is I want to hit it with the second prompt. I actually want to provide it a good working example of what a good resume point is. This is actually something that I created. Here's the resume bullet point that we're going to feed to the AI. It's recognized. It, it's got it. Now it is game time. This is where the magic happens. So what we're going to do is we're going to feed the AI a new prompt 
with an old resume bullet point in it so that it can improve it. I have a sheet that I've actually written out these props. If you want this, all you gotta do is just click in the link in the description. I'm actually gonna pin this comment with the link to this prompt sheet. All you gotta do is just make a copy of it free of charge, it's yours. What you wanna do right here inside of the prompt sheet is inside of these parentheses, you want to change out with your bullet point. This AI is actually going to rewrite the bullet point, specifically focusing around the skills of audit, compliance, and security, because that's the space that I work in. It's the non-technical piece of IT, cybersecurity, that doesn't require any coding skills, any hacking. GRC, governance, risk, and compliance. So we're gonna go ahead and submit this prompt now. So boom, now the AI is going to work and it has completely rewritten that resume bullet point, organize and manage regional customer deliveries, ensuring on-time deliveries of goods and services while adhering to audit compliance and security regulations, streamline delivery process, reducing costs by 25% and improving customer satisfaction. That bullet point right there is a lot stronger than the orig original, which is just schedule local and regional customer deliveries, coordinated delivery teams to meet delivery timeframes. This doesn't show the value that you bring to the company. This communicates value. And since we're on this baseline now, what we want to do, we want to hit the AI with a new prompt because we like this, right? So what we're going to do is we're going to say, hey, give me five additional bullet points. And it's going to give us additional bullet points based on what it already knows. And so we're going to be able to take these things directly from the AI and update our resume with them, which is completely next level. So that's the first one. That is a delivery truck driver. If you look at this, this is an easy way to transition into a tech career because it is rewriting what you've done. So you're actually gonna be able to speak to it. All right guys, so now we have the bullet points and let's go a step further. Let's ask the AI to give us a resume description that shows that we're transitioning into tech. Highly motivated, experienced professional with six years of experience in delivery management. Proven track record of effectively managing customer deliveries and streamlining processes to reduce cost and improve customer satisfaction. Skills in customer onboarding, system setup, installation, troubleshooting, data migration, inventory management, and security protocols. Secret to leverage, experience, and knowledge to transition into a career in the tech industry. This is fire. Yer. This is absolute fire right here. Okay, guys, so now you've had your resume rewritten by AI to help you make the transition into tech. So the next thing that you need to do is go over to linkedin.com, dice.com, upload your resume and build out your profile so that you can start being contacted by recruiters and you can start applying to jobs based on your new resume. So the cool thing about this is you're gonna be able to speak to the skills because it's all based on what you've done. It's just rewritten for this new industry that you're about to walk into. Don't forget, if you wanna access the Magic Resume document that has all these prompts for you to follow, go over to www.boycluers.com forward slash GRC dash magic. You can get it completely free of charge, no email or anything needed just for you. If you're looking to get the skills and the mentorship to take your career to the next level, even if you're transitioning with no technical skills, without a college degree or certifications, we can help you upgrade your job into a six-figure tech career in as little as 90 days at the Baxter Clues Training Academy. You can go over to www.boycluis.com forward slash GRC to check out our case study of how we've helped more than 700 people upgrade their jobs into six-figure tech careers. Apply to join this exclusive academy before all the spaces are filled. That's it for this video, guys. See you on the next one.